This is hydrogen tap. What you're looking at here is a new test jig I'm working on to measure the output of the focus Q. The bottom tube here, if you look at it here, this is the reservoir system for the focus Q that was sitting on the top. The top here now is a new test jig I've got for that and this is going to measure the output of the focus Q. I'm going to show you how that works. I made a few modifications to the reservoir system and you probably already noticed it if you've been watching the last few videos. You can see this is a threaded port here and another thread port here. This enables me to put more electrolyte in the system or more water. It's also a quick empty of course but the main thing was to be able to add to the reservoir. I couldn't do that before. What you see on the right side here is the new port I've added and what this actually is is a plug-in for the test jig and that test jig fits right on here you can see the bottom of it this actually unscrews there's two male threads here this now threads directly to the reservoir you just turn it like so And once that's done, you can turn it down tight. There's another view of it. It just turns down tight and now it's right directly over the focus reservoir, which of course is right over the focus cue. Again, one of the modification I made to the reservoir was this. This enables me to plug the, the test jig directly on top of the focus reservoir. And this, of course, is the input port that I can add whatever I want to the reservoir. Basically, it's the same fitting. This is coming along really nice. Now I'll give you a look at the uh, new test jig here. On the bottom of the jig, you can see this is actually two threads, one on this side and one on this side. This is the one that plugs directly into the reservoir system. The other piece is this hollow hydrogen gather system. I'll be putting a hole in here with a cork that fits on top of it and what's going to happen let me first show you the inside here. Well there's the through you can see that. So this fits right onto the focus reservoir. There'll be a tube that comes up through from the bottom comes up a little height here. This is going to be filled with water. This goes in like so. Fits directly on top of it. So the tube comes up to here about. And the, as the hydrogen is pumped in through there, it's going to make this rise. Now, there's a lot of others out that are using this type of system. I haven't seen any that are using it directly on top of their system like this. If so, uh, this is really going to work nice. And so you take this, it plugs directly on top, like so, twists on to the reservoir, and it's going to be really neat, I hope. This should solve a lot of the back pressure problems that I've had measuring from the Focus Cube.